The breaking story out west, that devastating wildfire growing in size in Southern California. The Thomas Fire, now the third largest in state history, threatening more homes and forcing new evacuations. The fire destroyed more than 1,000 structures, and firefighters are bracing for the powerful Santa Ana winds to kick up again. Here's ABC's Marcy Gonzalez in the fire zone. Tonight, fire crews waging an all-out war against this massive, unrelenting wildfire now the size of New York City. Crews climbing the California hills with chainsaws, axes, and shovels, desperately trying to get the upper hand. We're hitting this thing with everything we got. The inferno now burning for nearly two weeks. The wall of smoke at one point so thick it nearly blacked out the sun. Nearly 800 homes destroyed. Several more lost over the weekend as wind gusts topped 60 miles an hour. And you can see just how powerful the wind is here. It brought the flames in so quickly that fire crews say they didn't have time to get up here to save this home. It was really the most severe fire behavior that I've seen. That extreme threat forcing new mandatory evacuations. Celebrities among the thousands of people in the fire zone. Rob Lowe posting these photos of his home. And Ellen DeGeneres writing, our home is still standing, but so many have been lost. Firefighters continue to be my heroes. One of those heroes, Corey Iverson, who died fighting the Thomas fire last week. Today, hundreds turned out to honor the husband and father who was set to welcome a new baby soon. Colleagues mourning, but still on the front lines tonight, taking advantage of a short-lived break in the winds. We're expecting the winds to kick back up very severe on Wednesday. A timely rush to stop this fire from spreading more. The holidays are coming. Everybody just wants to really just, they want to get home. And you can see the holiday decorations still hanging at this home overcome by flames this weekend. Firefighters were told to plan to be out here until Christmas, but now officials expect this firefight to continue through the new year. Tom? Marcy Gonzalez right there in the front line.